gehört zu zocken. So, what's up with Wayland? Let's check. So, first let's check Sorg. Okay. Uh, implementation. How the X wing the system? Steward by Xorg Foundation. Corporate proclamation. So when is it started? Uh, Two thousand four. Okay, and let's check Wayland. Two thousand eight. Okay, so four years later. So the original author is some guy, but developers are free desktop we talk, which is Sounds cool. So let's try to do it. I mean, why not try it? Why not? Requirements. So there are a lot of them, to be honest. And only tiling. Ah, oh, okay. And state support. Ah, oh, there are. And this my back. That's why not. For native, that are yet not required to use it in stock. So X Island package. I don't like this. Why is it starting like repository and I was to be honest scared of this, right? Because actually I don't want repository. So, I don't understand, okay. Basement cage uh, inspired by the red poison. Sounds cool. Sounds cool. But it's out of a different compiler script. Any screenshot, guys? No screenshot. The replacement documentation software documentation package.
Display servers using the Rails protocol are called compositors because they are also act as compositing. Hard, too hard, guys. There is no such thing as start Valent. <laughs> and there is no such program as Valent. Yet, <laughs> Valent is a protocol, and, and there are multiple Valent compatible compositors out there. Plasmas, you can start from Valent. You need the compositors. Okay, no problem. Let's check out. Let's check out how tiny it is. Wait, it's it's amazing. We're not going to do it, sir. It's too hard. Too hard, guys. Okay. So let's finish up with um, with our uh, window manager. We will stop on so in case if there are actually uh, like. Server Wayland. Yeah, only two of them here. I guess I'll not continue with our window manager. <coughs> so I yesterday I think I created the three point. It's actually working right now. Why is not working right? Why is this not working? Well, yeah, wait, we just noticed the case where we have only two apps, okay? So we need to add
problem is uh, when I'm double clicking is it current window then but not current and not run but if there are actually like two Okay, so the, if this one um, so if this one will not work, nobody cares, right? Um, right? Yeah, right. Uh, it will remain zero. If this one will not work, the same goes. So if this one, if this will work. If this one will not work, okay. Um, then we will have to actually swap. Yeah, okay. So actually, let's add here some bool. No text file. stuff say wait what is the bull turn one return one return one so if nothing will succeed we will return actually zero Yeah, but here we don't really care if it will succeed or no. Because if we have no windows, we don't, don't even care. If this one will not succeed, yeah, we can say actually the prop is zero, right? If um, zero, if um, zero equals this yeah, we will actually say that prep equals zero uh, right. if it's double click yeah, but it, it cannot like set current to any but not current means that there are only two windows. So we will have to copy this construction. Make lock. Cool thing is that we actually have two apps, right? So, 
we are printing actually. Yeah, we can't actually do it because we are not. Trust uh, this one is not an app because it's like very small. So let's repeat again. Okay, we are obvious. Obvious. You see? So if we have only two apps. Is not working. I mean, double click is working and it is waiting. <coughs> it is actually like the mode that I will use all the time for for work because I will have like two apps. Okay, if I will make it a little bigger, things will be more accurate, right? You see? Here I will go back to obvious. I will go back to picture. Yes, and the last thing I wanted to is design. It's actually another click. So here I will actually set. We are switching between them. Okay, you see, and fast, really fast double click made me uh, swap. Yeah, that's cool. That's really cool. Yeah, that's really cool. Yeah, I think we are ready. Now let's actually check what we have between Canadian So I think we are interested in Canadian I think I will take Wait, I think I have it anyway. Um, so yes, one of the basic things that I will change is I guess this thing. So we are actually grab a key but yeah, actually, let's just try maybe. So, 
wait, 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 we are not finished yet. We are not finished yet, I will also try to do this thing. No, no, I didn't succeed. So it actually is changing focus also. What if I will do it faster? No, it's not yet working. It's working perfectly, but we are not hundred percent sure. Um, So I'm going to do main event. Okay, we are on main event now. And now we actually are going to come quickly and say like. We will do it only one time again. Then we actually don't need like this DPI because we can really have it from from somewhere. What? What is the type of your display? Well, I think I can say. have to open and close it. Okay, this one is of course needed. And I think yeah that's all. something like this and of course we will call it when I press like this F1 okay no it's this one it's actually I will uh, I will call it just VM and here I will add my tiny VM dot sync right
I think I did something. Check it so I'll stop the video. Okay, guys, it just crashed, and this kind of fun because we are actually going to see what's going on, right? So we will use GDB. Now we will in the mid there is no such process here. Are you kidding me? Supports. I don't know, so okay. So we actually stopped it, right? So if I will do something, I cannot really do it here. You see, I cannot move windows and this all stuff. But if I will like press continue, it is working. Now I'll press Alt F1 to trigger this crash that I had. Okay. In set current window. Okay. I'm going to. Okay. I'm going to open it. Vim. What is it? Uh, loaded C, right? Set current window, right? Set current window, yeah. So we are in set current window, and somewhere here we got an error. Okay, it's interesting. So, first, let's check like state again. Okay? state no system for locals okay guys I think I will need to recompile this yeah, I will need to recompile it so yeah I will stop the video I mean recompile it is um, oops Pilot with flex make file with flex and flex uh, I guess like minus G okay make okay so now I'll stop the video and continue okay so I turned on uh, around the 
debugging recompiled. So now it should it should work normally. So PS works. This format view. So Guys, I will actually reboot my PC. Okay. So peace oaks grab VM. Five three seven. Okay, it sounds strange. Why are we actually? I mean, this is actual Peter. This is a no PS Ox. Yeah, sexual process in here. Okay, let's check it out. It's strange because first time it worked, right? I would. Okay, seems cool. I don't know what is uh, this one, but I will just enable it. Okay, yeah, it works. So I stopped like my VM. Continue it. Wow. Okay. Um, so it it looks like XOR generated events and VM like after all will not hundred percent sure will you know. So I am pressing Alt F one. It is. Um, mm -hmm. Okay. So open this up tiny uh, dst so the problem is in set current function in low.c so let's print state okay state equals zero is it actually okay But like in our enum we have okay, so it is setting it to any. Okay. Okay. Oops. Um, so we are setting to any, okay. Okay. Ah uh, guys, I see I already see the problem. Um yeah, I 
you see it. So the problem is that uh, we are calling like this function and alt tab is being called uh, like from external stuff. So yeah. So how to solve it? Uh, we will have to actually pass this. Yeah, because like uh, we can see it. All right, let's check p dpi. You see it's zero. So this is the problem. So yeah. Just pass it through, you know. Just pass it through. Like this. And here we will also, unfortunately, pass it everywhere. Uh, DPI. DPI. Set character here will be also oops the same oops oops states and DPI yeah. We don't. We will not use like this one. Okay. So maybe it should work actually. All right. So where I'm using DPI here, 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 here. here. Yeah. yeah. It seems great. Yeah, it seems great. Okay. So yeah, I will stop this video again. Uh, well, first of all, let's remake it. strange you know but let's look a lot of hours <sighs> yeah I think here is a problem So where I'm checking my DPI. So where I'm opening display on that. Um, okay. Yeah, this will be kind of problem, right? But not really. Okay, I'll just paste this one here. Wait, it's actually a pointer. Make one too few. Update. Okay. So we are actually passing like DPI here. Okay. Okay, nice, nice. So yes, yeah, so now I will stop the video. But I really cannot stop it, so well. This is our old streams will be shut down, are you sure? Yeah, yeah, guys, I will stop it. Okay, guys, luckily it didn't work again, so. Be my 
the speed Pressing alt F1. Well, what? <laughs> it actually works. <laughs> yeah, the cool thing that I, when I was only one application, it did not work. Yeah, it's kind of crazy. Uh, okay, so I will stop the video. Yeah, because here you see it, it is working and it is working by the very, very cool. You see? So even I have like only two applications, it still works. Really cool, but I will stop this video because I'm going to exit OBS, so only bug like when I have only one application. But I will not have any only, uh, only one application. But never mind, I will. I will. I ha I have to do it. Okay, guys, I fixed that small issue. Um, and now check that. So I have OBS, and I press Alt F1, and nothing is happening because terminal is actually too small, you know, but uh, so it's not an app, so basically we have only one app, so and alpha one is, is doing nothing, so when I will actually uh, make it bigger, see now, now it's working, now it's actually working, but you can ask me like what if I will yeah let's have an example so I have a chromium okay so now uh, it's it's really working you see It's kind of working, you know. Um, to be honest, I don't really like it, uh, but it's kind of working, you know. Yeah, it's kind of works. But I would like make a delay more better, but I think it's not very important. Um, So, for example, you see when I'm doing like constantly, sometimes like it is switching and it is not very good. And for this, I will have to do another stuff. But first, like I will have to make some time manipulations. But first, what I want to show you is that imagine I have this window and this window. So, current window is OBS, previous is Chrome. So. But what if I, I will close actually this window? And now I will press Alt F1. And it will crash, okay? So. Mm, it will actually crash. So I will try to open GTB here. But I think it will like crash like. Uh, Will crash Xorg, so I don't think GDB will help. Yeah, so I'll stop this video. So we need to understand that. Uh, so what do we actually want to make sure we are safe? Is uh, is actually when we are doing something like I don't know. Like it doesn't matter what are we doing, but here we are updating. Uh, we are updating. Okay. 
so we actually want to check like if windows actually existing okay so basically we want to check if it was not closed okay so i actually need to do it somewhere uh, let's i don't know do it uh, somewhere okay so if current equals we just pick something if pref then we set it and what is this by the way oh, okay it's if we cannot switch okay okay uh, so when we have like both of them right uh, because anyway we are setting current to something right Here can be a tricky part, like um, I would say we will. Uh, so if we don't have current, it's also a tricky part, right? So yeah, actually, I would just like uh, add something here, like uh, check if cure uh, and ref windows uh, close okay and this uh, function will be just void check and it will just like say if cure then uh, then check check if window closed okay and we will pass like um, like a pointer okay and the same will go for ref and why will we are passing a pointer uh, oops is because we actually will change them so this function will be called void check if window closed and it will actually like take a pointer and sign right sign in right and it actually is going to take a window so and it will wait a pointer to a window right and it will actually like make some sort of stuff to check if window is actually present okay how to do it we will have to use a program called chromium Xorg check if window exists how can i check an exit if window exists Okay, guys. You know what? I have decided one, one, one decision. Okay. <laughs> so what I'm, I'm going to do is I will actually say like git add everything git commit minus n and then git and after all those I will just say pg roll.c I will make it bigger so I will not like do this whole this whole stuff is too far for me so what I'm going to do actually is just take uh, what I'm going to do actually is just take this part I will put here and just say 
change. Change. Simple, more simple. Simple, beautiful. So, do I actually need to set edge? Do I actually need root? Yeah, I actually need it for X query and also and those things also attributes I need for for size right or no I don't know um, no it looks like I, I need them only for wait I don't even need them wow yeah I think I don't, I don't really need them I don't need name also um, do I need this one yeah it's geometry stuff yeah I, I'll need all of those and this one will just basically say that yo um, like current current Calls. No, I'll just copy this stuff from here. Uh, I will say window current equals children return. I will also say return. I will remove. Uh, this is just a void and oh yeah it's really simple guys nothing fancy okay and I don't need and do I actually need attributes no I don't need attributes no I need those uh, I don't need this one. Uh, uh, uh. Just place it beautifully. Just make it cool. Uh, no. And that's all I guess, right? I think that's all. So instead of uh, tabbing, I'll uh, just say simple uh, DPI return. Make. Okay, and now I'll check and back to the video. Yeah, and it is working like um, it is really working. So uh, I think it is calling like simple stuff, and yeah, it is working. So yeah, of course, uh, like the drawback is that if I run like server app, uh, I will cycle always like one by one. Okay, so I will not like have this this uh, feature of like memorizing previous ones so I will just cycle through all of this. This is of course a drawback but keep in mind that uh, uh, when I when I actually like doing my work uh, I have only two apps and when I stream when I stream uh, yeah, actually I don't know maybe I can use Use two displays for streaming. I think that that would be a good idea, right? Two displays are just one virtual. Uh, I wanted to try. Anyway, yeah, that that is uh, going to be the plan. Um. Okay, so now let's make it not. Uh, so yeah, so we can move windows, we can resize it, we can alt tab, um, but yeah, but we cannot actually 
alt tab so let's actually make alt tab um, where is it it's here right wait 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 so i am registering f1 so can i actually like say tab Okay, guys, I will try it now. Yes, guys, basically I just uh, set tap and it worked. So yeah, guys, I think it's cool. It's cool. So I think I will keep using this uh, this VM like all my life, you know, because it's amazing. Um, yeah, so it's pretty simple, right? So. Yeah, so I don't know. Let's like make a new commit, uh, like couple of new commits. So yeah, guys, let's keep it simple. Um, the one more thing that of course uh, needs to be done, I think, is changing this stuff. So we actually are going to change it. So yeah, I mean, of course, this will need to be changed, right? But I mean, like vice versa okay so we will launch up terminal and while terminal if the terminal will be exited uh, then like the whole everything will, will needs to be exited right because if we don't have terminal we don't have anything right the terminal is the, the most powerful uh, yeah you know so instead of uh, pressing exec here i will just add this one and regarding this that's all so coming back to our like repository i will get everything i will git commit minus m uh, git push okay and now i will uh, check out to other branch git check out how to do it i don't know sorry guys minus b and call it simple and um, yeah and basically here i will just delete everything you know so I will delete through readme, uh, probably it should stay, uh, I will delete annotated, um, I will delete lol, lol.c, no, 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 I actually need to delete lol.c, no guys, wait, let's not delete anything, let's just, I don't know, git add, git commit, uh, nothing to commit, I want uh, lo empty. How to do it i don't know sorry guys so i will just uh, touch and get that get commit minus m get push okay so this command i think will be needed okay so basically it pushed so now i can get push like regularly okay it it is great mm. So now let's change some some stuff you know so we have like two files okay load c where this basically simple is uh, working right but i actually don't want this whole file so i'll just copy this i'll tap new and i will open tiny vm and yeah basically that's all so i'll just I don't know, put it inside of here. Okay. Uh, of course, this stuff will go to, to the top. Can I have something there? No, I think no. Okay, I will delete topmost, I guess. Yeah, it is not needed. And those comments are not needed. If I press on window, focus on it. Mm, no, I think, guys, I don't need this. I don't actually like want to focus on window. Or do I need actually? I don't know. I need to think, yeah, this can be like optional function, right, so. Oh my, so hard. Ok, 
the Alex comment out of this. Yeah, and start needs to be like because we actually are going to mover size point. <laughs> yeah, so this one is needed for resizing stuff. But oh okay, also this one. But setting focus I don't really think you know. And for this one, uh, maybe we can just like make um, like we can make you know this like behavior. So when I actually will do this, it'll like um, doesn't matter like where, where I press. And I think I like this actually, but I don't think so. Yeah, like I don't think I, I need, like I don't need to move this one or this one. Um, well, at least focusing. Okay, so focusing is not needed, I think, at all. Um, yeah, other stuff is pretty okay. I mean, I like this. Okay, and yeah. Yeah, I really like it, so I don't actually need okay, so like this one, this one, okay. Yeah, it's kind of cool, you know. Uh, yeah, okay. So I will delete these things this one. Uh, this one will be remain, of course. Okay, so we're left only with this one. And so if we are taping, uh, we are pressing something. We are going through three and yeah, so that's all. Here instead of return, I will say break uh, because yeah, I don't need a return. Okay, uh, and I think that's all. What do you think, guys? I think that's all. Uh, yeah, here just let's say. Children return I just not create some stuff. I mm. yeah, and that's all. Pretty easy, guys. Pretty easy. Okay, I will just make it more better. Okay, so in theory, in theory. I have done everything in my in one file, right? So, um, GT, GT. I'm just doing this to make sure that I saved everything because we will. Okay, so yeah, I will just make. Okay. Else without previous if. Without previous if else without previous if wait do I have an extra bracket somewhere? Yeah, I think this one. So I yeah, I think I need to remove this one. This one is better. Okay. So yeah, now let's also change make file. We don't need all anymore. We don't need any debug stuff. And yeah. Uh, also, I will add like install okay. Sometime. Uh, 
last section and there's another final one. Install install minus n seven five five right to execute VM VM user bin something like that I don't know. Uh, again, we are only compiling tinyvm.c. Uh, so make, uh, make. Okay, so now I don't have vm, right? But if I make install, of course, rule two, make install. Then I have vm, right? Yeah, cool. Cool stuff is going on, you know. Okay, so now uh, instead of um, we'll just have VM. Okay. Beautiful, right? So now I will check it. Uh, um, okay, guys, it's kind of cool, you know, because um, mm, it's kind of cool, you know. Uh, because so first of all it works okay second of all uh, we have installed it so I can run like ps aux wrap vm so first of all it is launched beautifully without like full pass okay so we are basically like using some git clone make make install and here we go um, second thing which is cool is that it is actually running in the background again uh, so I'm running like Terminator. Um, and yeah, so the cool thing is that uh, actually like when I close my terminal, everything will be closed. Of course, I cannot show you, but I will show you that. Uh, yeah, I cannot show you. Like I will test it now myself. <laughs> So guys, yeah, let's finish up this video about VM. Um, how we will finish it? I will just go to this stuff here, and I will just remove stuff. Okay, so annotate it. Um, I don't even need to read me. Okay, uh, raise uh, razor. tinyvm.py no? uh, tinyvm tags uh, lol lol.c ads uh, and of course vmls so we are end up with those two files so I will get commit minus n git push and yeah, let's check out like my beautiful repo. Mm, GitHub. Mm. So yeah, this is shit, but this is this is beautiful. Okay, only two files. Okay, and everything is clear. Okay, so we are using Altep to switch. Everything is super clear. That's yeah, super clear guys. It's super clear. Okay yeah I think it's all for VM so whenever I will install my Arch Linux I will just clone this and just make it because it is using a make file. So just make it. Uh, I also don't need uh, this clean stuff. <sighs> yeah, I don't need it. So I will make it uh, and I will install it completely cool. Uh, and yeah, let's one more thing. Uh, ls minus l user bin vm. Yeah, it's kind of cool, right? So everybody can execute it. Yeah, 
that's kind of cool. Okay, guys, so yeah, that's all for VM. So the next plan I think will be to set up terminal, okay? Um, OBS and Chromium we will not even touch. So the next step is simple terminal, okay, from Suckless.